Julio, obviously a very disappointing result in performance. What would you like to see after that game? Well, definitely not a performance that uh, you'd like to see as a manager. You know, um, a lot of mistakes uh, in the game that uh, obviously give them the chance to, to score a few goals in, in a matter of 10 15 minutes. And obviously, when you three down, uh, you know. Uh, it takes you even longer to get into the game, you know, when you, when you, ha when you don't start the game in the right way uh, and then make mistakes that the ones that we did, yeah, uh, it was hard to get back on the game. Uh, we have spells in the game where we done well, um, I think it was 10-15 minutes in the first half and uh, part of the second half when, when we created a few chances, uh, but yeah. Um, you know, when you play against teams at this level like Harrogate and you make so many mistakes, obviously you're going to get punishment. I think it was just a case of conceding the goal so early and not the confidence of the side and that sort of seep into a lot of the players' play towards the, the back end of the pitch there. Yeah, uh, well, we didn't even have the time to, to settle in the game and we were like two or three down. Uh, and as I say, you know, it, it's hard to get going. Um, so, you know, it's not many positives about today. Uh, it's, it's hard to take that. Um, especially when, when you know that uh, you got a team that uh, is capable to do things, you know, regardless of the score today, you know, myself and Tommy will believe that uh, we have a good team. We have quality players, uh, play players that can perform um, against teams like this. But for some reason, uh, obviously today we didn't do that. It must be one of those situations where you really want to see a strong reaction in training this week from the team as well to show how much they're hurting from a game like that. Well, I think the 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 way we train should be should be you know the same all the time. You know, uh, we we say to the lads we want them to train as we play. You know, regardless of what happened on the weekends, it's not like we're gonna punish them this week because we got beat six one. You know. Uh, they know they have to train hard uh, to get the rewards on, on the weekend um, and that's the way you always should be, you know, train a, as your best and then trying to, to obviously uh, gain a position in, in the team in the first starting eleven uh, to perform during the weekend. So this week is going to be, you know, um, a normal week, yes, we're going to work on, on the fitness, on the tactical side like we've been doing um, and then we're going to prepare for Gated. Of course, we've got Bolton CA with a lot of the younger players on, on Monday and then Gated on, on Friday. What are you going to be looking to, looking for this week over the, the course of those two games, would you say? Yes, uh, Monday is a game where most of the academy players will play in that game. Um, we might get to, we might get a few first team players involved in that game to get minutes. And then Friday, again, is going to be a game like today, you know, a team from uh, high in the leagues that uh, they're going to come and press us and play good football like Harrogate did today. They're not going to give you time on the ball. So again, you know, uh, it's going to depend on us on how to start the game, but we're going to make sure that, uh, you know, next game we start um, or we approach again uh, in a better way than today. Just finally a message for the fans today as well. I'm sure they'll be hurting from the, from the scoreline as well, but it's important to kind of stay grounded as well and, and, and know that there's no points lost at this stage, that there's still a lot to come from the team? Well, I'm hurt as much as them, to be honest. Uh, I, I, I'm very passionate, uh, obviously I hate losing and uh, when things like that happen, it hurts. But uh, the good thing with football is, uh, you know, in a matter of days, you, you, you have to have a revenge, a revenge and uh, Friday is, you know, is the, the opportunity for us to, to change things around again. So, as I say, you know, uh, the fans are always good. I don't have to repeat myself. Um, and, well, uh, I think they have the right to be heard today, you know, but uh, we're going to prepare ourselves right in, a, in the right way again this week to, to put up a performance against Gators.